Okay, today's drill we're gonna be working against is a jab. And what we wanna do is we want we don't wanna be there at that moment when the guy's jabbing us. So as we jab, we're gonna sidestep to the outside blind side, doing a pop with an oblique kick with a right leg, and then we're gonna forward that with a stump front thrust kick to the rear supporting third leg, and then follow up with a punch to the floating ribs, coming in with a wu sao and a bone sound, applying the pigeon of the hacking elbow to the spinal cord or the, or the kidneys. So it's all the lungs, depending how tall the individual is. So I'm gonna do the drill with your body in one position, then I'm gonna turn it around and see it from another angle with, um, with David, okay? They'll feed me, and then they'll do it themselves, okay? So this is the way the drill is gonna go, all right? So basically, we're gonna be lead to lead. When he throws me the punch, I'm gonna move to the side. As I'm on the side, I'm gonna kick, Cover my right side with a kick to the rear leg, punching the floating ribs, coming in with a wu side and a bong side, starting coming in and breaking the structure. Okay, that's basically what we're doing. I'm gonna do it with, with David in this position so you can see. Again, I'm leading, boom, boom, hit, and coming in, boom, okay? David and, and um, Giovanni will do it, all right? Nice and slow, one, two, Three, four. Giovanni, you do it. Slow. One, two, three, four. Okay, keep rolling. As you notice, David hit Giovanni in the floating ribs because Giovanni is much taller than him. Giovanni cannot do that with David because, being the fact, David is much shorter and his arm is going to be in a way when the execution of the punch is retracted. So Giovanni had to adapt at that moment and go to the exposed area, which is the face. Of course, for safety purpose, Giovanni overextend, bypassing the face, but the intention is that he is still hitting the face and he continues with the same flow. So they're going to do it 